All right, y'all, good morning, and welcome back to another video. So it's super, super foggy out here this morning. Um, I came out to Crystal River today in hopes of catching a big snook or really big redfish for that tournament uh, I've been telling you guys I've been doing uh, online. So I haven't been doing the best this month yet. Um, it's the 14th of April right now. So just kind of trying to give you guys a timeline. Um, I've only fished about two or three times this month, so it's okay. But yeah, I'm gonna throw around a lot of, you know, big fish baits, top waters, big swim baits, spoons, that type of stuff in hopes of finding them. And I even brought the fly rod just in case it's so shallow that the uh, big reds are getting spooked and stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna do my best. Hope to get on some nice fish for you guys. And uh, yeah, let's do it. Oh, what is that? the most baby trout of all time <laughs> felt like he had some good weight to him but <laughs> well first cast is out of the way i'll take it oh there we go we have a follower come on come on you got it That was a pretty big fish right there. Not really feeling this top water. I'm gonna switch to a different. Oh, let's try this bigger one. Come on. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, they're just small trout. Oh, he spit it. Dang. That sucks. Try that other one a little bit more. Oh, that might be a bigger trout, guys. Oh, man. I hope that wasn't my fault. This might be too tight. I don't think so. Oh, that sucks. God, what is it with me and losing these fish lately? What is that? That was, a, that was a crazy, that was a crazy trout eat. Might not be that bad actually, unless it's a red, but I can't tell. Oh, it's not a feisty little guy. Okay. Okay, we got him. Okay, I don't know if that's an upgrade from my last trout. Uh, that I logged, but we're gonna about to find out. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Let's get him on here. I mean, barely. He's like a. He's like a twenty. 21 maybe, and I think I logged a, a 20. Uh, we'll have to see. All right, y'all, got the fish logged. Let's go ahead and give him a nice little release. Really healthy trout. Ah, oh, sweet. He is all good. What is that? 
Oh my god, that thing was going crazy for it. Call me crazy, but that looked like a giant mangrove snapper. <laughs> oh, come on. This thing's walking like below the surface and it's still getting hit. Oh my god, that had to have been a snook, that was way too loud to have been a trout. Oh man. Got him. Okay, that's a snook for sure. Oh, there we go. At least we have a... Oh. oh, he's waking up. A little bigger than I thought. I thought he was small. Oh. Uh, I knew it. I felt him throw one of the hooks. Oh, bro. That sucks. That sucks so bad. Oh, man, that breaks my heart, man. Breaks my heart. I don't know if he bent the hooks out or what, but let's see. Yeah, he bent the hooks out. Not much I could have done there. I mean, if I let him go, if I played him lighter, he would have gotten to the branches and broke me off. And uh, didn't want that because I didn't want him to have a lure stuck in his mouth forever. But apparently that wasn't a problem for this one. <laughs> oh man. Well, that's snook fishing. Oh, what is that? <laughs> is that a pin? <laughs> Whatever it is, it's not very big. Oh, okay. It's an another trout. Let's see if we can get this guy unhooked because we're in prime, prime snook territory. I'm not even going to bring this guy into the boat. Perfect. All right, guys, fish on. I don't know what that is. Looks like a trout. A decent one, too. Got it on the bounce. I didn't even feel him. <clears throat> All right. Choke down the ultra paddler. Get a better grip on him. Yes. Sweet. Oh, that's a big fish. I have no idea what that is. Got him. Oh my God, what is that? Boys, we might have a really good trout here. I have no clue. Oh, the hooks don't feel like they're in there that good, so I'm gonna slow down a little. Oh yeah, that looks like a, like a decent trout. Not bad. Not bad, but it's definitely not bigger than that other one, so.
There we go. Perfect. Oh, that was a huge snook right there. No. Oh my God, I knew it. It was a snook. Maybe he'll come back for it. Oh no, it was a snook. Oh, that was a Mondo snook, I knew it. Oh man, he was just laid up right there. I thought it was a tree trunk. Oh, that was crazy. I don't know if you guys saw that or not, but that was a pretty big one. There's one right there, there's one right there. Oh, he doesn't want it. They're sitting just looking around though. At least I saw that one, so we're getting better. All right, y'all, I was on my way in, but then I thought, you know, let's just do one more spot. Let's try some like totally, let's try something totally different. So I'm gonna try some submerged oyster bars and um, see if we can pop a big trout or maybe a big snook off of these. And uh, yeah, I don't really know. I've had decent success with it, but they're not always productive. So I guess we're gonna have to try a couple and see. But yeah, let's do it. All right, y'all, I am absolutely beat. It is about four o'clock right now, and uh, I've been out here fishing since about 6.30. So uh, I've had quite the full day, and I've got to do it all again tomorrow, but hey, I'm not complaining. This is what I love doing. And um, tough day today, you know? We hooked onto a nice, like really nice snook, lost it, had a couple blow ups from some bigger snook, and saw tons of really high quality fish today, um, just exploring the shallows and different mangrove areas, but Nothing would, nothing really seemed to be working, and this tournament's a lures only tournament, so it's not like I could just go net some mullet, go, uh, go drift them through the flats to these trophy fish. So it is definitely a little bit of a challenge, but I know we're gonna make something happen here before the end of April and place in a good spot. Um, but I know it was a little bit of a shorter video and you know, not as crazy as usual, but I, I still hope you guys enjoyed it. And as always, if you guys want any of my baits, um, you can visit my website, omenlures.com. That's where all the omen baits are from. And uh, I love making custom orders for you guys, so feel free to experiment with that. But yeah, thanks again for watching. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.